Eden Park in Auckland has become an historic fortress for the All Blacks. No other arena in world sport comes close to the dominance the All Blacks have achieved here over the past 30 years. Tenakoto katoa, no mai haere mai, and welcome to the last home game of the year for the New Zealand All Blacks. The Rugby Championship, New Zealand and South Africa joint leaders separate only by points differential, so the remaining two games will decide the outcome. The Springboks and the Pumas playing in Durban. Well, tension, no doubt, in both camps after the massive game 10 days ago in Melbourne. Tackle, no, they've got to release him. So cleared away by Jake Gordon. Ala Ala Toa. Five metres on the All Black side of halfway and Gordon again. Swings it off to Big Jen. All the way. Puts up the gap. Now can he link up? What a run that is. Inside the 22. Gordon wants quick ball. And he gets it too. Now Foley. Away for Ala Ala Toa. Standing rather flat footed though. Now Gordon swings it off again. Pete Samu. Take it in the tackle of Ritali. Gordon again. Good start here by the Wallabies, but the All Blacks win this, a penalty. This is not going to be good. On this one, ben, yeah. He has literally yeah, there was a, earlier picked up Dalton two Papali'i. Australia, two Australia. And he okay, has dumped them down. Now they will want two to check Australia how he has landed. Yeah, it's a lift and clear out, just a penalty. And a neck roll. Oh. Yeah. OK, time off. Nothing on the screen there, but... I've got four taken above the horizontal, not four to ground safely, and it's a, it's a yellow card against the referee four. Yes. and the two. Yeah, so number four, taking the player above the horizontal, not four to ground safely, yellow card four. Yes. Yeah. Number four. So he's sick there, yeah. Well, that's the eighth yellow yeah, card yeah. that the Wallabies have caught safely, in the rugby championship. Now Smith, the All Blacks put pressure on. The Aussies are man down. They're going to concede a penalty. Controlled by Savia. Away for Smith. Back to Savia. Breaks the tackle. Slips it nicely to Taylor. Still Smith is after it. Has to flick it between the legs. Now Moonga. Away for Jordy Barrett. Off to his brother. Bowden Barrett with all the pace. Slips one player. Slips two. Bowden Barrett. Caught a Betty getting across. Gets a nice bounce. And runs it, yeah, into yeah. touch. Five metres they'll go for the line-out. Ha-ha! <laughs> Magic man, Bowden Barrett. Away it goes for Cotabetti, and he's in real space here. Kicked it a bit early, but he may get a good bounce. He does get a good bounce. Oh, well done. And he kicks again. All Blacks getting back. Jordan, a couple of Wallabies coming hard, and they can't... Yes, they... Oh, hey. Got him the second time. And the All Blacks pinned back near their own goalposts. Good Ball's coming balance. for Smith, though. And off it goes to Bowden Barrett. And the All Blacks happy to hoof it into touch near the 22. Boy, up and down we go. Energy sapping stuff it was. The yeah. kick, the regather, okay, and then the kick go. again. And traffic was outstanding. The chase, the work rate's there. Now Aaron Smith, away for Lomax, goes hard, good run by Tyrell Lomax, now Smith, hands it up for Yuani, playing under advantage, and the penalty coming the All Blacks way. Yeah, just to, to just hold on. And the referee wants another yeah, word. Yeah, I've got penalty here as well, Matt. Just hold on. So, Moanga. It's taken just over 20 minutes, but we finally have points on the board, and the All Blacks lead by 3 to 0. Again, it's there for Smith. Now Moonga slings it out for Papali'i. Mounting the pressure as Moonga had to stretch a weaver. Now Jordan! Will Jordan! This guy is a freak! Will Jordan gets the opening try of the test match. Too much gas. He had too much pace for Jordan to tie out. When he got his hands on the ball, he just backed himself. It was a really nice sequence from the All Blacks right from the set. They had some really nice interchange of passing with the hot feet. Will Jordan gets on the outside. He can't match him. Jordan Pattaya. Oh, magic.
And maybe, just maybe, he's been given a brief to just be roaming a wee bit more because he's got his hands on the ball more tonight already in the minutes we've played than he has in prior test matches. He's good. But You're not. Had to release first. It's Tom Wright. And off he goes. Drops a little Play interesting off. little kick in. But it's been nicely snapped up by Jordy Barrett. Slips a clever pass to Moana. Here's the counter-attack. Rico Ioane with his pace. And Will Jordan knows run away from him. Rico Ioane looked to be lining up Will Jordan. So they go back the other way through Retallick. Right, that's one side, now yeah. Smith, under penalty advantage. Jordy Barrett, Moanga. And they've lost control of this finally. OK, he never got back onside. Oh, he's decided he was offside now. Sure, thank you. Right takes it down. And the All Blacks set it up pretty nicely too. Close to the line before penalty try. Penalty try, the Wallabies dragged it down. And the All Blacks get a seven-pointer and the Wallabies get a yellow card. It was always going to be a big problem for them to try and defend the situation. Number two, collapsing them all. Being under penalty pressure, if they did something Can't illegal, which they did, it was a nice peel away from the All Blacks. Adi Savia was in control. Pordek, he's the man who brought it down illegally. So, so let's have a look. The All Blacks, they get it really well set from Whitelock, and they peel away to the right as we look at it. The Wallabies had absolutely no answer. Look at the numbers compared to the Wallabies trying to scramble back. Savia's at the front, and it's being pulled down illegally. Now they need quick ball if they can get it. It's very slow. In fact, it's been stopped by the All Blacks. So Wilson hands it off to Bellatini. And the Wallabies oh, threatening near the try line. Sullivan in. Gordon looks across. Neville. Nice. Oh, Connor Betty. Come off. They'll check it, but it looked okay to the naked eye. Okay, so I'm, I'm playing good on the ground in match here. Yeah? So left foot clearly yeah, in touch. Definitely on the line. So Go this will be scrubbed out. Oh boy. So maybe a high up and under or another tap kick. Goes with the former. Clark waits just out from his own 22. Caleb Clark laying it back. Wallaby's looking to step over the top. It's there though for Smith. And clever play, and off goes Cody Taylor on a big run. Sets it up for Jordy Barrett. And the All Blacks are inside Wallaby Territory to regroup. Slings it on for Bowden Barrett. Nice pass to Jordan. Now Will Jordan lines up Aaron Smith. Great tackle on him. Ball is there for Savia. He unloads the Retallick. Still 10 metres to go here, the All Blacks. Akira Ioani. Using power. Looks to free it up. The All Blacks oh. penalise. I think it's Pete Samu. I've got, I've got good. I tell you what, runners. the All Blacks, Seven, when they break one. out, are simply fantastic. They make a good decision. Set. <laughs> Smith gets it in. Now releases to Geordie Barrett, the first receiver. Good tackle by Foley. Now they go wide for Taylor. Here's Jordan. Oh. Boy, that's a good front tackle, on tackle oh, by Corabetti. Onside. Ball is there. Taylor once more. Release tackle. Only a metre short. Whitelock has oh. a crack. And Sam Whitelock. <laughs> held up, I think. <laughs> Referee yes, right there. Yes, yes. No yes, celebration yes, yes. from uh, yeah. Roy okay. Max in particular, who is right behind him. He might have lost just his off. I just want to have a quick check. Ben, can you hear me? To try and get underneath him, Balladers propels himself forward with the help of Lomax. No, he lost it. Has he? Yeah, he hasn't got control Still of that. No. Somebody Still got their hand on it. Like still okay, Next so it's angle. not Angus yeah, Bell's hands, that's his left hand, really tight which one is here. on the ball yeah. now. No rush. His hand yeah, is that? That's hand. the question. If that's Whitelock, it's got the, it's the right wrist brand. If that's Whitelock's hand, has he ever lost control? Back to the ball all the time. 
and then he bounced the ball, so it's just it's a foul. Yeah, I know, but he's still in control as well. That's the other hand. Okay, so two hands. Yeah. Try's going to be given. It's a rare one for Sam Whitelock. Suddenly, the All Blacks out to 24 to nil. Oh, they batted away, did the All Blacks. Davia gets the call. Here's Clark, bursting into the clear, but held on to by Alalatoa. Big tackle that. Now, Moonga using his footwork and slips the pass nicely. Here's Jordan and Will Jordan and Adi Sabia. Again, Smith swings it off to Whitelock. Geordie Barrett, Lomax again, prominent tonight with the ball in hand. The Wallaby oh, trips in there, you won't be able to get out, so it's a penalty, advantage. Now the little tap through, but no All Black within Kiwi. And so back for the penalty no, they'll the come. TMO confirmed. Moinga kicks the penalty, and suddenly the All Blacks out to a 27 to, to nil lead, and I think that will bring a fair few nine, Wallabies onto the nine. field. One by Whitelock. Another golden opportunity here for the All Blacks. Taylor's got it, latched on the back, trying to keep it as straight as possible. This looks really good. Taylor goes to the line. Cody Taylor scores. And the All Blacks have four for the evening. And set piece has been simply outstanding tonight for the All Blacks. The scrum has been absolutely monumental. And equally, when they're getting into the right zones, their line out more execution is absolutely pinpoint perfect. Cody Taylor gets his hands on the ball. He gets the momentum, shunts it forward, shunts it forward. And then there's just nobody there to stop him. Yeah, look at Jason Ryan in the background there. He's absolutely pumped about this performance. Carried on by Valentini. Vantage offside. Now what? Your yeah. Blacks offside. Ball left behind. Thumping defence okay, okay. by the group. Okay. No, 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 no. It's completely legal. Look, it's completely legal. Nick, it's completely legal. You've got a penalty there, okay? Oh, well, he's got a bit of attitude. Like him. Huh? Ethan the group. Oh, oh, oh. Three and nine. Black, yeah. the man on the receiving end. Yeah. Like a Waititi. Folding in half, yeah. They've seen him on the big screen. Stay square. Use it. Finley Christie. Both down. Slings it wide. Oh. Barrett. Well, he's been a bit of a revelation oh. in that 12 jersey. Moonga partially charged, so everyone's on side. Now yeah, here's Samu, back gets back. it back and down, beautifully picked up. And the try is scored. Back off black, try is good. Rather fortuitously, but the Wallabies will take it. Palau Fahing has scored it. Outstanding from Tex Samu as well. Look, they worked hard to get the charge down. The energy levels are good. Connor Betty gets it shot. Fayenga shifts it onto Samu, back on the inside, off a Will Jordan deflect, deflect, and then he has enough momentum to bounce right. over. There's yeah, some great intent from right. Australia, and off the bench it Just came to. Uh, it was I've Nick Frost. Who yeah, was the man that originally the made the charge yeah. down? Yeah. Not he lost that forward in the end. I think he probably got it on the line, but. All Blacks opting for a line-out, which has been won by Rotelli. But now watch Taki Oho here. If the All Blacks can get cracking. Don't change. Don't change the outside. He's got the ball. They're going straight. They're getting a bit of help from the backs. They go to the line, and they score another one. Sama Sonny Taki Oho. Out there's a sense of inevitability about it, wasn't there? The minute they got set at the back, they got it moving. It went static for only a brief amount of time before the backs added some more weight to it. And after it got its second movement, Dolkiaho, nice and patient. You can see there it's set. They do well, Australia, to stop it at the first point. But then Geordie Barrett and Caleb Clark 
and they push Tokiaho over. 15. Oh, your fingers, Richie McCall, making a comeback. The crowd's gone nuts. <laughs> Turn on. Oh, that's impressive performance from Bowden Barrett. Working hard. Turn over to ripped away by Reese. Big turnover, Sebu Reese. Now, short pass for Satutu. Off it goes to Clark. All Blacks inside their own 22. Tom Wright goes west. It was so good. Caleb Clark. Tom Wright, Tom get off. out of my way. Drops the hip. Puts him on the grass and powers oh, on. The breakout from the All Blacks outside their 22. The ambition to play. Outstanding. Tuanga Fasi takes it into contact. Yeah. Okay, it's there for Christie. Hey, Referee's put the arm out. Here's the Tutu. Gets it off to Whitelock. Still working hard, the skipper. Christie again. Now Mwanga. Attempted it intercept. 18. And uh, back they go for the penalty. So the penalty goal landed by Mwanga. And the All Blacks hit 40. And lead by 40 to 7. Oh, he has had a great game, Sam Whitelock. Now White, a little hesitation, Neville. Pop That's wide, good. chance here right on the left wing side. Corabetti oh. over the top of Christie. White pops it up. McWright. On the side. White again. Goes wide, Pataya. And Jordan Pataya. Grabs a consolation try for the Wallabies. And they finally show some good full retention, the Wallabies. This is Corabetti. He knows that he's got power when he goes into contact. Perfect. Now, so does Finley Christie. They hold on. The All Blacks keep trying to come forward, but here, very good decision from Nick White to miss out Fa'a Masuli and hit Pattaya underneath the post. Yeah, for Pattaya, he will have uh, the second last say. They'll kick this conversion as well. You would imagine the Wallabies, it would be Reese Hodge, but it's been conclusive, absolutely conclusive. And the All Blacks stamp authority on it. Yes, they certainly do, Smithy. The Wallabies got a couple of converted tries in the second half. The damage done in the first half, when they led by 17 to nil. They've outscored the Wallabies by five tries to two and have come away with yet another win at Eden Park. So the record goes on. Final score here, 40 to 14.